It's that time of the week again, my friends. Oh, yes, it is Friday reaction video time. I hope you are ready to get scared out of your brains. I know I am. As you can see on the screen already, Sir Spooks, that's what we've got up for today. I'll leave a link in the description below, but go over to his channel, subscribe, like, do all that good stuff. But yeah, guys, without further ado, if you're ready, I'm ready. Let's do this. Hello everyone, my name is Sir Spooks. Hey, what's going on, we'll Sir take Spooks? a look at the top five scariest videos for when you're home alone. Oh yes, so let's I am begin. home alone actually. Number five. Come on then, let's start off strong. Do you remember your old high school projects that you did all those years ago? Yeah. It's probably something no. that you don't think about and for good reason. Yeah. It's hard not to cringe at our past selves who act so much differently than we do now. But usually, watching <laughs> Not really. videos of yourself from your high school days. Can I just say as well, everyone uses this B-roll. Everyone uses this B-roll. Every time I watch a, a horror video or scary video, like top 10, I always see this and I always go, I've seen this one. But it's just because everyone uses this B-roll. It's, yeah, it's, it's funny. Every time I see it, I'm like, I've seen this one. But anyway. This brings nothing but embarrassment. However, for this one man, he will forever look back on this video and view it as potentially cursed. Okay. On October 30th, 2012, a YouTuber named What, what Is That 09 what is uploaded that? a video to 09. his channel, writing in the description, quote, I was recording my brother for a high school project and he was looking back through the bloopers and he noticed this thing. Okay. End quote. The uploader is quite vague in terms of this what it thing. is that can be seen in the video. So let's take it into our own hands and see exactly what he's talking about. What I think of is Ace Ventura there. Go. The band we chose was the Taiga Border Forest, which is located in Russia, Northern Canada. Oh! Oh, you can still see it! It's there! It looked like a monkey! At first, this appears to be a typical high school project video as we yeah. watch the young man speak to the camera about something okay, he's well, the learning about The dog doesn't seem to school. react to it. While his pet dog can be seen walking across the top of the couch yeah. right behind him. But it's what appears in the window that will cause your heart to stop. It looks like a monkey. A strange face can be seen peering in from... It, it, you, you see what I'm saying? It looks like a monkey face. But the other thing as well, once it comes up, he starts laughing. So I don't know if that's just a coincidence. It could be, to be fair. But that honestly, I mean, it's, I mean, how small is that head as well? If that is real, it's tiny. Look at, this is the windowsill and that, I mean, this is about the size of the dog's head. So I don't know. It kind of looks like a monkey though. So maybe it's something outside. Maybe. I don't know. But I guess if, the, if they've uploaded it and said, this isn't right, then I don't know, I don't know. From the outside looking in, although it can only be seen for a moment, it is still terrifying to look at. The uploader further clarifies, quote, It couldn't be my wiener dog, because even though he jumped out of the couch, the curtain is still moving and you can still see the face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It couldn't be the camera or our reflection, that was my initial because thought. we tried it was the dog redoing reflection. it and nothing came out, end quote. To this day, That's this weird. YouTuber has absolutely no idea what he was able to capture on camera that day, and I'm sure he doesn't ever want to know. But let's just hope that whatever this thing the is, dog doesn't, react to doesn't it, come back to haunt this man or his brother ever again. The only thing I can think of is it's something far away, so the distance makes it look like... No, but that... Yeah, I mean, it could be that. I, I, the only, my only explanation is it can't be a reflection. Uh, well... It could be a reflection of maybe the camera guy's shirt, maybe. Maybe. There's a few things it could be, but that is weird. That is, uh, it looks like a monkey, though. Yeah. Yeah, so I know I keep pausing. I apologize, guys. It, the, now that I've said that, it could be a reflection of his shirt. Maybe he's wearing a monkey, like a Planet of the Apes shirt, and it's reflecting. But because he stood there filming him, Obviously, he, the monkey's not going to move. So, because it's uh, it's still there once it's like swinging and stuff. So, yeah, that that's my explanation for that one. But that is creepy. If I saw that back, I'd be like, "What the hell was out there?" Creepy. But then his ears kind of in the way. So, number four. That was a good one. I like that one. The following video was published to YouTube on February 28th, 2010. 
okay. by username BDK Music, who is trying to film a video ago. inside of his house in the same style of the popular. What are we recording? Uh, it's 10 years ago, I suppose. I can barely see this guy. Television series MTV Cribs, taking the camera around the house and showing various Stay rooms. This. However, this would ultimately not be the type of video that BDK would end up filming that what day. Are we even at the start at of the right video, now? he explains to the camera that he is currently filming the footage at 4:20 a.m. Yeah, loads of dead before bodies. walking around the central living room slash kitchen area, okay. where the television is turned on and one of his friends is trying to relax. Okay. But fascinatingly, something terrifying has already happened, if you can believe it. It's definitely one of yeah. those things where if you aren't paying extreme attention, you would certainly be forgiven for missing it. Okay. Take a good look at the doorway in the background right, right. here, okay. as BDK starts to approach his friend. Hey guys, it's Brian here. Um Brian, mate, I can't see you. I can just see your eyes, so... Fix your camera, my friend. The, the compression is terrible on that thing. I'm just at the BDK house, you know, nothing too much. It's 4.20 in the morning. Uh, is see. that a joke? 4.20? 420? 4.20, man! Okay. Uh, TV's on, girls gone wild, nothing new. Everyone's asleep over here. Everyone's asleep? And they got the TV blaring? To be fair, having said that, whenever I've had a sleepover, there, there's always that one guy that, like, is so loud or is doing something stupid and will not let you sleep. There's always a Brian. His name is Brian, right? Yeah, there's always a Brian in the group that has to be doing something. And you're just like, shut the F up, Brian. I'm trying to sleep. Yeah, the Brians of the world, they make you lose a lot of sleep when you're when you're younger. But yeah, I, I mean, I don't know how they're all asleep. I assume they're drunk. Uh, hey, there's Tim over there. What are you doing, Tim? Hey, Tim. Oh, yeah. Oh, I saw something. Uh, it was like a shadow. I, I didn't I didn't get a good glimpse of it, but in the doorway, definitely. It's already gone past, so I'll have to go back. Get some stuff out of my head. I got a lot of ideas. Okay, he's rapping. An indistinct shadow figure yeah, yeah, yeah. can be seen looming in the doorway very yeah. ominously, but can never be seen in the video again. Could it be Despite a dog? the fact that this video is 12 years old, it only has one comment from yeah. somebody who believes that BDK was able to capture some true paranormal activity on camera. That it, it, it can't be. It can't be Brian. There's no way it can be Brian because it's moving too quick. The only thing I can think of is maybe a reflection of something, but it's really, really small. So it's like in this area here. I don't think it's up here. I think it's just in this area. So my first initial reaction is maybe a dog. Maybe dogs walk past. But yeah, that, that's that's weird. That is weird. But it is a bit strange how this Tim guy is the only one awake. So, yeah, I don't know. There is something, though. That day. I don't know if you can see it. But what do you yeah, think? Yeah, yeah, you saw it? Did it's either a little kid or a dog. BDK it, it's one of the two. actually managed to accidentally capture a shadow figure on camera. Is this just a creepy prank that he pulled yeah. in order to get some internet fame? Be sure to let me know in the comments below. I mean, I'll be honest with you, you can barely see it. But it is, it's definitely something. Number three. Okay. It goes without Come on. saying that TikTok is well. absolutely loaded so far. with like billions it. of accounts. Billions, even. Ah, uh, TikTok. Some of which are genuinely funny sure or interesting, TikTok. whereas others are questionable, to say the least. Yeah, exactly. One of the more fascinating accounts is called Our Haunted House, which is run nice. by a homeowner who frequently uploads videos of their house that they believe is haunted and after you see this is why i don't like stuff like tiktok and stuff like that because the the channel or the the whatever it is the channel is called our haunted house so naturally they're already advertising that the house is haunted so more people are going to follow and then they're going to do stuff around the house to make it seem more haunted so this is where i'm not too sure about so yeah we'll see uh, i'll know straight away whether it's completely fake but yeah, th this is why I don't really like to you watch this eerie video, you might want to sleep with the lights on tonight. Oh, I hope so. The video so. starts off with the I homeowner mean, well, describing really. that he's going to record himself watching television for over an hour. Okay. Just to see if anything happens during that time. Sure see, enough, it does. Bit of a coincidence that something happens. Come on then. What am I looking at? What? Okay, the door's slightly open. Door is ajar. Okay, great. Oh, oh, 
Oh, it's open. Yeah, it's opening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe someone behind the door. I mean, that's an easy explanation. Little by little, the door behind the uploader can be seen creaking open. Anyone else was thinking of Oasis then? If no one got the reference, I'll shut up. Slowly but surely, all while he lay on the couch, completely unaware of what's happening directly behind him. Someone could be behind the door. If you thought that moment was creepy, I assure you it only gets more terrifying from this point on. Good, Take good. a look into the dark abyss right here. Yep, yep. I'm looking. I'm looking. Dark abyss. What the hell? Now, the only thing I can think of is that this is like a candle. You know those fake candles you can get and you can turn them on? The reason I say that is because there's a reflection up there. So whatever this is, this light is reflecting onto, I guess, the ceiling? Although, how the hell is... Uh, how the hell can you see the ceiling in there? But that's my that's my initial. That's first thing I thought of was when I saw that was that's a candle. But there is another one. And finally, there Jesus. are two other genuinely unsettling moments that candle? happen in the video before it eventually ends. As the uploader lay on the couch, resting as best as he can, some absolutely chilling weird. things occur right behind him before something manages to startle him awake. Okay. I'm waiting. Come on, something good. So far, I can explain everything. Okay. What am I looking at? What am I looking at? What? Oh, yeah! Ah! Uh... Right. Right, 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 right. Okay. I think I can debunk this. Watch the hand. Watch the hand. I mean, it could it could not be it. Wait, wait, wait. Sorry, my bad. Hang on. So wait for the hand. The hand comes up. Creepy. Yes, my initial thought is a person. But then how does the person get round? So this hand here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You see this? Right, now it goes away. Watch down here. You see this here? There's like a little black shadow. Of some kind. Now this could be this could be a ghost, okay? And the but why would the ghost crawl under here and then go for the hand? So this here is a shadow, in my opinion, of someone who's crawled underneath, put their hand up and crawled the way back and gone inside and then slammed the door. See the shadow? Shadow's going in and then the door slams. So I mean, it could be a ghost. It could be a ghost. Sadly, the video went right there, meaning that oh, we don't and know also, that... right? Watch it again. Before the hand comes up, there is a shadow that goes toward, like, round the back of the 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 couch. I guess you'll see. Sadly, it. the video. So here, 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 here. There's already a shadow before the hands even come up. It went right there. Meaning Hand comes that up. we don't know whether or not the Shadow's uploader conducted still here. an investigation that night after watching the footage back. Hand goes down, simply shadow, went back to bed. in you go, Although The second option slam. is without question the wiser choice. It would definitely be think better if there one. was a third option. Move out. Yeah, that just looks like, I mean, that. now that I've seen that, that just looks, definitely looks like a reflection of like a candle or something like that. It's a shame, but this is why so I don't like the TikTok think? ones, because they're, just, this they're just too much. Is this genuine footage of paranormal activity much. happening live on camera? Is this entire video a hoax? I'll let you be the judge. Yeah, I mean, even the hand doesn't look quite right. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I would have, even if that was a joke, I would have absolutely crapped myself on that. Even if I knew it was coming. That was loud. But then again, it's weird how the dog doesn't react. On July 28th, 2015, a right. YouTuber known as Yams uploaded hey, Yams. a video which showcases him and his friend Bryson sitting okay. outside, trying to make the most out of the hot summer day. Yeah. Upon first inspection, this video appears to contain nothing out of the ordinary. Okay. In the footage, we watch as Yams and Bryson throw a ball around outside for Yams' pet dog, Ellie, to play around with. Yeah. It seems like a wholesome video that would be able to bring a smile to your face. Okay. And if it does, then I promise you that See, smile will wrong. be gone very soon. 
Okay. All seems to be going well as Shams throws the ball for Ellie a few more times yep. before something nearby suddenly gets his attention before he asks Bryson if he too sees what he's looking at. Okay. As the seconds tick by, it becomes all too clear for the two friends that they are most definitely not alone in this area. Not by a long shot. Dude, do you see that? See what? No, dude, what the heck is that? No, dude, do you see that? Oh my god. Dude, Bryson, tell me you tell me you don't see that. What am I looking at? What the f It's got no head! It has got no head. Also, can I just say this thing is massive? I it could be someone just in a suit, I guess. Firstly, it's got no head, but then I guess you could hide your head, I guess. Maybe. Yeah, I guess you could hide your head inside something. But that is... Is it just me or is that person massive? Like, if you look compared to the tree, it's going to be like seven feet tall, easily. I mean, I mean, you could be seven feet tall, I guess. But that's weird. No way. What is... What the hell is it doing with his arms? It's like flapping them. Ah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It looks creepy. It's got no heads, but the the way that it's flapping its arms. Ellie, Ellie, come on, come on. Thankfully, the two boys are smart and decide to grab Ellie and hustle inside as fast as they possibly can. I don't know. I don't know. Not wanting to stay outside for even a second longer, just to be on the safe side. Judging by the distinct appearance of this strange and so there honestly is no head by the looks of it. Maybe it, maybe it's not quite as tall as what I think. I don't know if you heard at the end there was like some sort of like growl at the end. It sounded like one of their friends in the background, but that's weird. That's really weird, really, really weird. Yeah, that's really weird. But I don't know. I don't know. It can't be real. They're so calm about it. If I saw that in the forest. And I have lived in like the woods, I say forest, in the woods, forest, yeah, whatever. I would be absolutely, I would not be filming it. I would be in the house and then maybe filming it in the house, but I would not be stood outside because F knows what this thing is. So yeah, they are very, very calm about it. And also the fact that the dog doesn't respond is, or react to it is really weird. Why aren't these dogs reacting to it? My dog would react to any. My dog reacts to a fly landing on the, the kitchen glass or something like that. It, I don't know. Yeah, I don't, I don't know about Entity. that one. It, it doesn't seem real, but... come to the conclusion that Yams may have recorded genuine footage of none other than Bigfoot himself. Of course, this is just pure speculation, but it is definitely an interesting theory to consider. This video was uploaded... What's it doing with its arms? What is it doing with his arms? It, it's so weird. It just looks really, really weird. I don't know. Yeah, I don't, I don't know about that it's one. It's seven know. years ago, and we still don't have any concrete explanations for what Yams recorded that day, meaning that this incident may forever go down It's also weird how they see it mystery. when it's sat down. It does look well tall, though. Yeah, I don't know about that one. Number one, come on, finish on a bang. A YouTuber Key named Razor. Razor 88 uploaded a truly disturbing video to his channel on okay. August 16th, 2010, yep. which showcases the uploader as he ventures out into a dark and creepy forest in the cool. middle of the night Perfect. with a friend in the hopes of <laughs> trying to take photographs okay. of paranormal orbs. But what they ended up capturing instead was something yep. far more substantial. Perfect. In post-production narration, T Racer explains the scenario in detail saying that he and his friend were absolutely obsessed with the paranormal and right. learning more about it, which is why they ultimately decided to investigate that particular forest that night, okay. which ended up being a mistake. This sounds good. I, um, I really hope it's not over-the-top fakeness, you know? I want something really, really cool. Uh, I've done stuff like this. It's creepy as hell. I must admit, I haven't got like all the equipment and stuff, but I've been into woods and it's just your mind just anything you hear a stick break and you think you're about to get killed it's yeah i've had i've had some crazy crazy moments in forests i'll tell you that 
T-Racer shows us a handful of pictures that were taken in the forest that night. Okay. All of which appear to be completely harmless and Yeah, they look pretty looking. calm. That is, however, until he gets to this photo. Okay. Okay, and then we came across this one. And this is when we started to notice something odd. What am I looking at? Now, Tom's the one that actually pointed this out, actually. Uh, he's the one what? in the photo. Um, as you can see in the center, looks like a white figure oh, of some sort behind the tree. Here's the picture cropped and... What the fudge is that? Oh, I hate being a skeptic, but is that just not one of their friends? Is that not just one of their friends? Although his hands look really messed up. They look like claws. They look like daggers on the end of his fingers. But is that not just one of his friends? Brightens. Uh, I have not done any editing besides those two things. The first thing I noticed about the picture is the hand uh, wrapped around the tree. It looks like the fingers might be a little messed up. All right, now right away I thought it was some kid messing around with us, but everyone with me was accounted for when I took the picture. And honestly, I didn't stay around much longer after we saw this, so uh, maybe it was a kid. I don't know. But did they see it in person, or did he see it in editing? I thought he said he saw it in editing. So how did they, how did they know it was? A, they said he didn't stick around very long, but I didn't think they saw it until editing. So yeah, I, I don't know. I, again, my the skeptic in me says that this is just one of their friends messing about. I guess just to get a good shot, and then YouTube, you become famous, blah blah blah. All that you know how it works. No, oh, but the head and the eye placement are just like strange, and it also has no hair at all. Now the picture scared me at first, but it also made me more curious to find out if there actually is something in Whitney Woods. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, I've been in Whitney Woods a lot, and there's never been anything like there at all. And this is the first substantial like picture I've ever caught of like something like this. So I don't know what's going on. If it... right. also, what are these up here? These two orbs, or three orbs, or is that it just in the tree? It's real. If it's not, if you zoom in. You can clearly tell that there is most certainly something there. So you've got the eye. I don't know where his other eye is. His friend and some much unwanted Mouth, company. Nose, hair. It can definitely be hard to determine what exactly this entity is. Although, if you look at it like that, look at the hand. That hand is messed up. Like, that looks messed up, that hand. It doesn't look like a normal person hand. Normal person hand? You know what I'm saying. Yeah, that looks weird. It does look weird. But by this one photo, we can tell that whatever it is has long fingers and a small head, leading many to believe that this is an authentic photograph of some sort of skinwalker. I knew that. Now, were whether say or not skinwalker. that's true is entirely up for you to decide. Yeah. T Racer says that upon noticing the creepy entity in the photograph, he promptly left the forest and went home as soon as possible. But I thought he said that he saw it in editing. I mean, here's the other thing. I know I keep pausing it and I apologize, guys, but here's the other thing as well. Like, when you go and do these investigations, like, if I ever, I'm telling you now, if I ever go and do a ghost investigation or go into some creepy woods, creepy house, whatever it is, creepy prison, I don't care. If I see something on the camera, you know for a fact that I am going to investigate. Unless it's a, a real human, unless I know for a fact that it's another person and I'm probably going to get killed, then I'm, I probably won't go up to it. Uh, having said that, this kind of lo looks like a person, so eh, I, don't, I don't know. But I don't like it when people see ghostly things and then they don't investigate. They are there for ghost investigation. So it does, it does do my head in sometimes, but... You're in the heat of the moment. You, you're absolutely crapping yourself. Like I've been there. I've been in woods before and nothing has happened, but I've still been absolutely scared out of my mind. So, yeah. Uh, I don't know. It does annoy me when people don't investigate, though. Which was definitely a smart idea. If he wasn't so quick on his feet and his decision making, who knows what this weird strange looking. figure could Look have possibly done. Look at the size of his done. fingers. Whatever it is, it wouldn't have been anything good. And that was the top five scariest videos nice. when you're home alone. I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, absolutely subscribe for more scary content. Yeah. My name is Sir Spooks, and I'll see you all in Take the next Take it easy, video. Sir Spooks. And there we go, guys. Thank you very much for watching Friday reaction video done and dusted. Hopefully, you did enjoy. 
If you did enjoy, you know what to do. Smash that like button. And if you want to see more content like this, subscribe. Obviously, I upload the reaction video every Friday. Obviously, don't miss out on that. I will leave a playlist above my head for more reaction videos. Click that. Hopefully, you do enjoy. But yeah, guys, thank you very much for watching. Have a lovely rest of the day. I'll catch you in the next one.